So on April 4th, I went over this plane crash that happened outside of New Jersey Regional Airport in Manville. And we had a lot of comments about, you know, the crash and what happened. And we always try to figure out, you know, why the plane crashed. But rarely do we get to hear from the pilot's point of view. So today we got an uh, interview from Fox Channel News 8 on Zach Guthrie. And we can hear from him and what happened. 270 horsepower turbo plane flying into the ground. And that's really why it's a miracle as far as being able to walk away from that. I mean, looking at the damage of the aircraft, I mean, it really was a miracle. He was coming at a pretty fast pace from it, what it looks like. Zach says everything was smooth until he tried to touch down. As I came in, the forecast were uh, headwinds. And when I got to the ground, it was actually a tailwind on the plane. Uh, and then that's when I went ahead and began to flare over the runway. The wheels touched down once, uh, went ahead and hit the brakes. The plane jumped. And then that's when I made a decision to go around. So with the tailwinds, would the windsock show the difference between the forecasted headwinds and the tailwinds? And then also, is there any way he could have corrected that or was going around the only option? I began to climb up off the runway. I was unable to clear a tree. A tree hit, and then for the rest of the cr crash, I don't. It happened really, really fast. Yeah, so you can see it was a Mooney M20M. And uh, I went over this crash earlier. I saw the fire. Again, the back of your brain is working so much faster. And it's just, get, it's just saying, you get out of the plane, you, whatever it takes. Yeah, so he must have been in survival mode, fight or flight, working off of a lot of adrenaline there. I crash, I lost my glasses, my phone went into the plane, and I just wanted to get out of the plane. And so I hit the door the first time, and it didn't move, and then I hit the door the second time, and then it finally opened. So with fire on the uh, aircraft, from what he said, a lot of times, you know, you have to do the decisions on your own as a pilot to save yourself because by the time fire gets on scene, a lot of times it's too late. So good on him. I will never stop learning about things about this accident and ways to prevent it. God really provided a miracle just that no one got hurt. Yeah, so he has an awesome attitude. Glad he's okay. And if you want to watch the original uh, video I made, you can click it here. If not, hope you enjoyed it. This is Arfa Ramkioni, and I'll see you guys next time.